Hey everyone, it's Kyle, Azora Hype. The Witcher Season 2 has stopped production due to coronavirus, but there has been some very interesting news with a few new casting additions featuring a new Witcher never seen before in the games or the book series. The Witcher has cast the actor and stuntman Joel Adrian as a new Witcher named Hemric, according to RedanianIntelligence.com. Apparently, Hemric is a Witcher from Kaer Morhen, a new location and Witcher hub we will be visiting in Season 2. We got the casting news just a couple months ago that we would be seeing the appearance of fan favorite Witchers Cohen, Lambert, Eskel, and my personal favorite Vesemir. This is super important as Geralt and Ciri converge there, delving more deeply into their plotline in the first real novel of the series, The Blood of Elves. However, Hemric is a completely original character that we've never seen before in the books, so we can't really predict what may happen with this character in Season 2. Honestly though, after watching Season 1 and seeing how good the adaptation was, I'm really excited for these new characters and changes that weren't featured in the books. I think it brings an exciting element of surprise, making for not only fun speculation, but potentially exciting deviations for the story as a whole. I'm wondering if we will see this character in a flashback, or if he is a character that is also accompanying the Witchers we already know will be at Kaer Morn from the books. One thing is for sure though, Joel Adrian is an accomplished stuntman with appearances in Into the Badlands where he has really really badass fighting scenes, Rise of the Skywalker, Marco Polo which was an awesome show on Netflix, the upcoming Matt Reeves Batman movie, and also Fast and the Furious 9 which also had its release date delayed into next year because of COVID-19. I'm really excited to see if Joel will take part in some of the training of Ciri at Kaer Morm with Cohen and the other Witchers. There is certainly the potential that there will be big changes from her book plotline as Ciri is never with Geralt when he meets with Nivellen, who will be played by Christopher Hivju. I could see that plot change being really fun as Geralt plays Sherlock Holmes trying to unravel the mystery of what happened to Nivellen. But again, this brings up the debate of will we see more flashbacks and storytelling from Geralt and his point of view, or will we see characters like Nivellen and Hemric meet Ciri in the flesh in Season 2? We know that The Witcher Season 1 played around with different timelines, but I expect we will see less of that in Season 2 as we get the convergence of characters, much like we saw what happened in Season 8 at Winterfell and Game of Thrones with characters like Tyrion, Daenerys, Jaime Lannister, and other major characters showing up at Winterfell. Either way, it's going to be super fun to see where they go with the Kaer Morhen plotline as it's a fan favorite location and plotline from the book series. I know there is some skepticism about introducing new characters and leaving out old familiar characters from the book's alienating hardcore fans. But we have to remember that the show is having an enormous impact on the books as well, helping people get into the books, and if I can remember correctly, in January I couldn't even order a copy of The Last Wish and the first few novels on Amazon because they were sold out. The Witcher Season 1 had a similar effect that the Game of Thrones TV show had on the A Song of Ice and Fire book series. George R. R. Martin went from having 15 million copies sold to over a whopping 70 million. I believe that that figure is around 90 million sold worldwide now, so that is a positive aspect that the show will have on the books and for people picking them up and getting into the series. Either way, this is exciting news as we haven't had very much on the news and the filming and the casting front due to what's happening with the virus. What are your thoughts though? Are you excited for more Witcher casting news like what we talked about in this video? And have you enjoyed the adaptation of this show so far? Let me know whether you're a new fan of the series or a hardcore fan, what you think about this news in the comment section. Also, if you want to see more Witcher content, I have an awesome podcast with Aziz from History of Westeros and Mikkel from Vassals of Kingsgrave called The Podcast of Surprise. It's an awesome Witcher book club and podcast, and we currently actually have three episodes covering the first three short stories in The Last Wish, The Witcher, A Grain of Truth, and The Lesser Evil. So if you're into podcasts, you're into book clubs, or you're just into The Witcher, feel free to check us out on Anchor and let us know what you think of the podcast by leaving us a rating or review on one of your listening platforms. I'll leave the link in the description of the video for those of you who are interested in checking it out. Also, if you made it this far, thank you for watching the video. As always, I really, really appreciate all the amazing support, hype, and love all of you awesome people show me. If you do want to support myself and the channel, you can do so by tossing a coin to your YouTuber and becoming a patron on Patreon. 
You can pledge anywhere from $1 and up for awesome bonus content, Patreon-only polls, and more. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video. Hype and love. Mm -hmm.